We're here with Don Larson, salesman at House of Clocks in Linwood. Don, tell me about the Kit Kat clock. Oh, with pleasure. Uh, started in the Pacific Northwest in Portland, Oregon, oh, a little over 80 years ago. And after a year or two, they moved to Seattle. And uh, mom and pop plastic mold company made them there for, I think, believe 46 years consistently. The originals all had electric motors that you had to plug in the wall, but they were all American made. And then about 35 years ago or so, a gentleman from San Juan Capistrano uh, bought the rights to the clock, moved them down to uh, still be American made, only in uh, California, but still kept the look, the feel, the ambiance of the true Kit Kat, but added to it a Miss Kit Kat, uh, the female version, and put both of them in a variety of colors, uh, even sports team colors, and uh, still very accurate, battery operated, the tails keep wagging, the eyes keep moving, and we're pretty proud to have them. What does the clock mean to you in the age of the cell phone clock? Totally different. It's the romance, the history. Um, anybody has a way of keeping time, and I'm one of the world's worst timekeepers, as my friends and employers will announce too. Uh, the clock itself is, like I say, more the item, more the art, more the history, more the culture than uh, just a timepiece. Um, it is nice to have it work correctly <laughs> and make you accurate and on time, but uh, it's the uh, more the romance of it. Don Larson, salesman at House of Clocks in Linwood, thanks. You bet, thank you.